If you've ever played on PvP Legacy, then you know it's about PvP. Let's go! And there's many maps. But do you know there are many easter egg secret rooms and cool features in a lot of the maps? Will me and Casper MC took time to look for them? And we're gonna show you. Before this video continues, please like and subscribe. It would mean the world to me. And we're almost at 2k. This took a long time to film. Alright, so the first special easter egg is on Grand Sky Islands. So you start out on the spawn island and you just walk along the path. We're gonna make our way to the main island. So, basically it would be good if you have an axe just to make it, well, not take as long. But you can use your hand, it's all good. Alright, so we're gonna make our way to mid. And then me and Casper will show you. So basically you go to the tall tree and you want to mine straight into it. Down there, there's going to be a room with a lantern and a chest that has a dead bush containing Bane of Arthropods 2, looting 3, and I'm breaking 3. Okay, the next easter egg isn't that hidden, but it's still cool. It's on tropical islands, so you're going to spawn and go to the ship. The spawn's right over there, so it's really close and easy to get to the ship. So, once you get here, you're basically just going to open these trap doors and go down there. There's going to be a dispenser in the back, which does have a potion of nausea. And there's going to be a chest with some basic things that you could find in a dungeon or something. And on to the next one. Now the next three are actually all on the same map, and it's Desert Canyon. So these next three, you're basically going to start out and go to the farthest away temple building. And once you go down here, you're going to mine in, and boom. Open the barrel, and there's another enchanted bush. It's an all capital and red letters bush with look of the sea one. From here, you fly straight past where you spawned. Into one of the corners, there's this little well. Is what it appears to look like. Make sure to use blocks, water, or dig down because there is dripstone below. Okay, so once you get to this room, there's barrels and there's this cool looking banner. All the barrels are empty, but this banner I think looks really cool and I think it's a nice little easter egg addition to this map. The last thing on this map for now is a neat mine shaft which they did build to look really nice, so you're gonna go to this ravine and dig somewhere around here. And then, so you don't have to dig down too long, you'll get there pretty quickly, it's not that bad. But you're basically gonna fall into what looks like a normal oak mine shaft once you go through the cave. Alright, after going through that tiny mine shaft, you go to the cave, and this would lead you to the big nice mine shaft. So it's a little bit of a maze, and I'm sure there's a lot better, faster opening to get to the mine shaft. but this is the way that I found, and I don't know any faster opening, so it's not there. You basically come down here, go down this little pathway, and then you would turn left here, and here is the mine shaft. I like it because it's really detailed and it looks nice. And on to the next one. So the next place or easter egg is at the Colosseum. So you're going to go through here once you spawn and you're going to go to this building. It might seem like nothing but it isn't. So you're going to mine through this like weird gravel and cobblestone patch. gonna go around here you can basically go through this temple and into this nice throne room this next one is you can find it really quickly it's at the map lava pit so you're gonna run to one of these cobblestone spikes and through it is basically a enderman's player head so I'll get it so I can place so we can place it down and show it for you guys there we go 
and it basically looks like this. It's pretty neat. There's one on this map, and that's the treasure easter egg for Lava Bay. And the next one is at Mountain Valley. So you're basically going to head towards this tower and this flag with water. And you're going to go straight this way into the woods. Now this isn't that hidden, but it's kind of cool if you don't know where it is. So it's a little log cabin or shack. You can go inside. And there even is some iron blocks and a basement. In here, just some empty barrels. But it's some nice little secret things. And it's just fun to find. And this house on, just only doesn't have a basement. It also has two upstairs. Bedroom. And a little chill room. Like a librarian or bookshelf room. On to the next one. Alright, so this is a little parkour for course Casper found. You just walk past the signs that spawn into the black concrete. You basically have to go up a lot of black concrete stairs. And make a couple hard jumps. But overall, it's a pretty fun, nice parkour course. And it does keep going after you hit the rooftop. You have to bounce off the slime onto those stairs. But that's all I did. Don't leave now, because I saved the best for last. Alright. We got one more. Then my personal favorite. And then one last one. Alright. So, basically, the next thing is where you go and find pre-custom crystal duels it's not really too much of a big deal but it's a cool way to like go straight there for a little hidden review i lied the best one is in the last one the best one is this one coming up so once you go back up here you're basically just gonna run back to where you spawn Alright, so go to the back of the big place where you spawn, go up the tree, and once you get up the tree, you're going to have to do some jumps. There's going to be a cool nether themed little build up here, and it's also going to have a lectern. There's also a button in the middle, and we have not pressed it, so here's a reaction. Button. Whoa. Whoa. Hit it again. All right, so the very last place is where you find the pre-custom UHC duels. So you're going to head off to the left side of that building, go up these steps. It's pretty simple, but it's good to know. Anyways, that's basically everything. I hope you guys had a great experience. Go find those Easter eggs and have a lovely day or night. And subscribe. Comment if you want more content like this.